How you doing, Mr. Sheep? How you doing? Yeah, I'm excited too. <laughs> hey guys, welcome, welcome. Um, what is this? <laughs> this is our new survival world, actually. Um, our vanilla survival world. I need to be specific there because um, I actually have a lot to talk about in this episode about what's going on with the channel and what I'm planning on doing. Um, but before I get into all that, the sun is rising, and what goes up must come down, right? So, where am I going with this? We need to <laughs> hurry up and get some food and hopefully kill some sheep. Um, so we can actually sleep through the night. And, oh no. Oh no. Okay, it went away. I thought I was about to sneeze. <laughs> um, so I hope you guys are having a great day. Um, and I hope you're going to be excited about this series as much as I am. <laughs> um, for those who have been with the channel for a while, um, you probably know I, I had a survival world a while ago. And we actually got, well, I say we got pretty far, but... W we didn't really get that far. Um, I was really happy with that world, though, and um, I would have brought it back if I if the terrain change didn't go on, and if well, see, there's so many new people on my channel subscribed to me that a lot of people would have no idea what was going on. So I just felt like it would be better if we just started over. Um, because we could easily get back up to where we were. Um, definitely. Um, not to mention those those older episodes aren't the aren't, aren't my best. <laughs> Just put it that way. Um, I mean they're they're not bad, but it was when I was first starting YouTube, and it has well, I have grown in my <laughs> speaking skills. I guess would be the <laughs> the best way to put it. Um, and this this tree, I don't know why I'm 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 <laughs> I decided to take down the whole tree. Um but yeah, my my speaking skills and well, YouTube skills in general <laughs> were not the best. Um they weren't terrible, but I mean they did they did get us our first um hundred subscribers, so I must have been doing something right. <laughs> Or you guys just felt bad for me. <laughs> um, I never actually did a 100 subscriber special. And I actually have... Oh, well, I hope I have. Yeah, I believe I actually have a flash drive on my desk right now. With a screenshot I took of my first 100 subscribers. Um, because I was planning to do something special one day. And I never did, <laughs> never got around to doing that one day special. Or that, that special one day. Um... So I should probably do that at some point. <laughs> um, maybe when we hit a thousand subscribers, I'll do that. Um, so you can look forward to that. Um, I'm not sure exactly what we'll do. My idea in the last world was to do a little like shout out to everyone who was um, part of that first 100 group. Um, so I might still do that, but let's go ahead and, you know, there's coal right here. Let's go ahead and take this coal. Um, let's make some sticks. Uh, and let's go ahead and get ourselves some coal. But yeah, maybe I'll do the same thing. Um, I guess I could... See, I think I was thinking before, I'd do like a little um, cathedral thing. Um, and just have... Uh, excuse me. Everyone's name... Uh, written down. I've been burping a lot, actually. I don't know why. I th it's probably because I, I, I drink a lot of Dr. Pepper. It, it seems to happen whenever I drink Dr. Pepper. But, um, yeah, I, I, I guess I could I could build a, a cathedral thing for everyone to have their name written in. Um, hopefully, I still have some people subscribe to me that are part of my first 100. <laughs> or that would be kind of pointless. Um, Though, maybe I'll do something where if you, like, if you say in the chat that you're part of the first 100, I'll, I'll give you, like, a another shout-out. 
just to, you know, <laughs> fill you up with shoutouts. <laughs> um, but that would, yeah, I'm probably gonna wait until we get 400, not 400, we have 400. Or I'll probably wait until I have, um, a thousand subscribers before I do anything like that. Um, just grab all this cobble here, and we can start adventuring. This looks like a nice world. I actually have not looked at this world whatsoever. I did that on the last one. I looked to see what was around and stuff. Um, but I guess on this one we'll be flying blind. Um, so. I think first thing we need to do is get some food, and then we can worry about maybe going back up there to that hill. And yeah, there's there's enough sheep. We need to we need to grab some sheep for for our bed because no one likes um what does no one like? No one likes um working in the night. Uh, unless you're mining, of course. That, that I guess that we could do that. We could just mine during the night. I think that's what I normally do. But since we have the sheep here, and oh no, did I get the wool? Um, I did I get the wool from that? I don't remember. Did, was that my second sheep? <laughs> um, no, I guess it really doesn't matter. I can just go up here and get another one. Um, but yeah, we're probably going to move on from this area since it's really, there's a lot of mountains. <laughs> just going to put it that way. <laughs> a lot of mountains. And uh, I want to have some flat ground to build on. And that's another thing we should probably think about. Now for the first couple episodes, um, we'll probably just create a basic, um, basic hut to start gathering materials. And then like in between episodes, I can just freely dump stuff into chests so I can, you know, start get gaining ores and stuff and materials, but, um, we need to think about a theme to go with, because I, I've thought about some things. Oh, no, this was, these guys are special. Is there another sheep around here we can kill? <laughs> I feel bad about killing these sheep, because these were in the opening of the, these two sheep are what's going to make this whole series possible. All right. Well, I'm sorry. It's it's night time and I need I need wool. Okay, I'm really <laughs> I'm trying to find this is stupid, but I'm trying to find another sheep. Um Oh, uh, whatever. I digress. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> uh let's let's go ahead and spend our first night on top of this mountain, I guess. Uh what are we playing on? We're playing on normal. Um but yeah, as I'm as I was saying, um, earlier, we need to think about a theme. I haven't really thought about one really. Um, though I have, I guess, a couple ideas I could build off of. <laughs> so apparently, my game just crashed. Um, I think it was something to do with my graphics card, and it actually set me back <laughs> before I'd even placed the bed. <laughs> um, but yeah, as I was saying before, <laughs> I got interrupted by my computer here, um, and my reasoning for placing that down would be. Oh yeah, cook some food. Um, oh man, I'm used to FTP where you can just like scroll the with the mouse um, wheel <laughs> to uh, put coal and uh, things into uh, inventories. Um, here, I actually need to eat one of these really fast. <laughs> so, <laughs> as I was saying, um, as for the the style of our base, um, I don't really know, but I would like to do something kind of different. And if you have any ideas, of course, put it in the description. We could actually do something really cool with this terrain here, because there's like a, a flat area right in, at the base of this mountain. Um, but I think we'll just go exploring out and seeing what we can find. Um, I want to be a little... Well, I want to... Um, to a degree, I want to take the game a little slower. Meaning, I don't want to rush straight for like diamonds and enchanting table and the nether all within you know the first two episodes um i want to kind of take it a little slower and focus more on building um whether that be mob systems or um towns or something um 
but I want the series to last a lot longer and I want to be able to uh, not feel like I need to record and not feel like I'm forcing myself to record, <laughs> if that makes sense. Um, I want to have fun with this series and um, if I feel like I'm constantly just running to, you know, get chanting as fast as possible or something, um, it makes the game not as fun. Um, I'm also not going to try, or I'm going to try not to strip mine as much because that's one of the things I'm bad about is I, I strip mine a lot. And um, even though I don't mind putting a good hour into strip mining, um, it takes away from the gameplay, especially because strip mining is really easy because there's no, no danger whatsoever. Um, and I want to, I also want to think of some challenges maybe. And maybe that could be one of them uh, is no strip mining. Uh, maybe we can have like a no strip mining rule. Um, it's good for materials, but in the end, it, it does like caving is a, a big part of this uh, game, and by strip mining, you, you really you just take away from that. And uh, so I wanna I wanna see about setting up like little challenges like no strip mining or oh my goodness we could live over there. Is my render distance? What is my render distance at? Twelve chunks. Um. Okay, I guess that's fine. <laughs> um. Yeah, I want to think of like little challenges, like no strip mining, or um. There's like a there's, there's one where you can like no no planting saplings or whatever, kind of like in real life where you know, <laughs> in real life for those who have not been outside and spend their days inside playing Minecraft, trees do not grow in a couple days. So, or, well, less than that in Minecraft, I guess. It'd be like one day. Um, oh! And kind of similar to um, in real life, I could go without planting saplings. So I feel like that would take away from a lot of farms I could um, possibly set up. I think we're going to set up over here. I kind of like the look of this beach and... Um, uh, there's nothing down here. I like the kind of look of this, this beach with the... Uh, Spruce forest. I kind of, I really like spruce forest now that they don't have snow. Um, I don't know why. It's just I, I like. It looks more like a forest. It looks more like a, like a pine forest. And those have always interested me. Um, that looks cool down there. Maybe we'll go down there and check that out. Um, oh my goodness. Looks like there's a swamp over there. Um, we probably shouldn't be <laughs> looking through the world. Ah. Okay, we're generating new terrain. That's that's uh, that's why all this is happening. <laughs> um, let's see here. We grabbed our bed. Yeah, we did. All right. Let's just find a spot. I'm thinking this first episode, maybe we'll just find a spot and maybe start caving. Like I said, I'm gonna t take it slower. It might see. It might. It might. Um. I don't want to have boring episodes, but at the same time, I don't want to be like. Hey guys, here's another Minecraft episode. I, uh, you know, built a wither skeleton farm, you know, in between episodes. Here we go. Let's look at this. All right. A couple of days later. Okay, here guys. It's a, a blaze farm or something like that. Like, it's. Oh, look, some pumpkins. We'll grab that. Um, even though I guess it's, it's a lot more interesting for the viewer to see a lot of progress, it is heck on. Our, yeah, it's heck <laughs> on the YouTubers who do it. Um, I mean, if that's their thing, they like to make a lot of progress. That's awesome. And I, I know I like watching a lot of progress. But at the same time, um, it's really, really difficult. And unless this is your full-time job, and this is not my full-time job, um, I I just, it's, it's really stressful. <laughs> and, uh, um... I hear a cave, um, but as I was saying, I don't really want to focus on just making loads of progress. This is a cool mountainside, actually. We could do something pretty cool with that. I'm kind of just thinking of ideas of where we could put our base. Um, that's actually really cool. What could we do there? We could do like a horseshoe, like wrap around the mountain. Thing. I don't know. Hmm. 
But yeah, so things happening around my channel. Um, I guess as we walk around here, I'll just talk about some things. Looks like there's a cave over there. We'll probably, probably just head over there. Um, so series going on. We'll have this series, the Minecraft Vanilla Let's Play. We're going to have a SMP Let's Play, hopefully, coming up soon. Um, by the way, I didn't mention this. We are, um, sorry, just to change subjects really quickly. Um, we are on Snapshot 14W. 21b this is 1.8 snapshot so for those who don't know there's a new block called diorite and anisite and um one other one i don't really like them personally i mean they're cool and i might build a little bit with them but i don't like how they spawn so often and if you also didn't i'm going in circles here <laughs> if you also didn't know there's a way to change generation now so um i basically turned off all the generation for um, those blocks. I could have turned it down, but I decided just to completely turn it off. I don't know why I keep going in circles. Let's grab this, um, let's grab these right here. Um, Sugarcane is their name. <laughs> uh, but yeah, I just turned it down. Um, I can show you guys how to do that if, if you want. Um, Dom, there's multiple videos, and it's really straightforward <laughs> on how you do it, but, um, oh wow, what is this? Oh, that's cool. That is really cool. I do not want to update this because I feel like that's all going to break if I do anything around it. Um, here, let me light this up. Okay, I guess we're, I guess we're settin settling down here. <laughs> Did not mean to place my bed. Um, yeah, let's just grab this. <laughs> um, but yeah, so we'll have this. We'll have hopefully a SMP Vanilla Let's Play coming up. Um, and then we'll have Life in the Woods as our... Um, non-technical mod pack, and then maybe we'll have a technical mine or mod pack. See, the thing is, I can't. Um, I, I can try, but <laughs> I, it's really hard for me to keep a schedule of make you know this amount of um, Nella videos this week, and then a certain amount next week, and um, kind of like I want to have a schedule, especially this summer. Um, because I'll be out of school, it'll be easier for me to set up a schedule of videos. But at the same time, I get my my moods really change. Like I really like Minecraft. Some days I won't want to play Minecraft just because I get bored with it. Some days I will get tired of just vanilla, and I'll want to. This is like the never-ending vein. I think we went from iron to coal to iron. Um, sometimes I won't want to play life in the woods sometimes i won't want to play specifically i don't know resident rise is a mod pack i've been playing um which is like another technical mod pack for those who don't know um but my moods really change and so i like to have a lot of series to basically um switch from so if i'm i'm bored with the series i can just move on to the next one still put out videos for you guys um but at the same time, I will enjoy it a lot more, and I am going this way now. <laughs> uh, I get, I don't know why I keep getting backwards in this cave. Um, so yeah, that's the plan, um, is to basically have a couple series going, and then be able to switch back and forth from them. And then if one point, um, God forbid, we uh, end a series, <laughs> um, we'll still have a lot of other series to... Um, fill that that space. Um, I I want to have a schedule in the means that I want to be able to say I want to put out, you know, a video every two days or something. Um, but at the same time, I don't want to um, say I'm gonna put out this like I want to I don't want to say <laughs> I'm gonna put out a vanilla episode this day, a uh, FTB episode this day, and um, so that basically forces me to make an episode even though I don't want to. And I don't think that would be good for um, for the episode if I have to basically force myself to do it. Um, so we're going to sleep here. And we haven't got much progress made. Um, <laughs> I promise I'm not trying to overdo the slowness thing that I was talking about. But let's just, uh, let's just see what's on the other end of the spruce forest. And then maybe I'll cut, gather some wood and build us a little starting hut 
so I can do some mining in between episodes. Um, and what I'll probably do is basically work on the hut next time. When I say hut, I mean like a starting house. And then, okay, good. This this spruce forest goes on for a while. But I'll probably work on the hut next episode, uh, mainly. And then in between um, the episodes, I'll mine a little bit. And then the third episode, I'll probably just do a mining episode where I, I explore and do a lot of mining. Um, just because I have a lot to talk about, I guess. Um, so that's the plan. Um, but I'm going to go check on how much time, because I'm really bad about... Um, oh, here's a nice cave. Oh, goodness. That's nice. Okay, I like that. I'm going to start mm. off here. <laughs> uh, I'm going to go through this cave, but I'm going to check on the time. See if I have any time left to um, do any building. And I will be right back. All right, guys, we still have a little bit of time left, so I'm going to keep going on here. Um, I, I just I, I don't look at the time whenever I start recording, and I, I never keep up with it, so <laughs> I always have to keep checking to see how long my videos are. So I, I've been, uh, I just collected some cobble on the edge of this cave here, um, uh, and I, I collected some wood as well. Um, I found this little little cove right here um, where this little river comes out into the the big deep ocean so I am cooking up some iron I already made an iron pick but I'd like to make an iron shovel um, yeah and then yeah let's kind of make an iron sword as well um, and you know what let's make an iron axe while we're at it and you know just to be wasteful let's uh, Let's just throw all the extra tools over here. Um, so yeah, let's go ahead and start building this hut. Um, I want to get as far as we can before I end the episode. Um, and look at those mountains over there. That is great. I don't know. I have no idea what the seed is. But um, it seems pretty great. Um, whatever it is, that would be blocks. There we go. I'm starting to get used to that. <laughs> so I'm thinking for our first little hut, um, I want it to double as um, a not just a starting hut, but an actual building we can use in our little town over here. Um, and I want it to be like a, a lumberjack's um, house, like out in the middle of the forest. Um, we'll we'll grow some trees back because I, I cut down the trees right here just so I can have some room. But um, we'll, we'll grow some trees around here so he has a lot to work with. And then I'm thinking we'll probably build a bridge going from here to there across the little river. And then maybe we'll even um, fill this river back up since it's kind of dried out going off that way. Um, but we really need to hurry. <laughs> um, so I'm going to go ahead and clear this area out. Let's see here. I'm thinking, let's go ahead and stand back and try to figure this out. I'm thinking we'll take spruce logs, go... I want to have like a little outside area to cut the wood. It's not going to be a sawmill, so there's not going to be... I've seen about this. There's not going to be a saw, like I was thinking maybe iron ball, bar is going to be a saw, but this isn't going to be a sawmill. Um, this is just going to be a lumberjack's place. So let's go one, two, and then let's get some dirt so we can have some blocks to build off of. Um, we need to go one higher actually. Um, this is going to be like a little outside area. I don't know why I just did that. Um, a little outside area so that the lumberjack can store his wood. I'm thinking. Actually, let's... Okay, I have an idea. Let's, <laughs> uh, let's take this. Let's make ourselves a crafting table real quick. Um, let's put this right here. I think we have one downstairs, but this will be fine. Let's go and make some fences uh, out of this these sticks. No, no, I'm about to sneeze. No, uh, uh, I don't like sneezing. All right, so let's go. Actually, I'm torn. Okay, let's go. <laughs> one, two, and then let's go. One, two, three, four. Five. Five, one, okay, Cal, you're in my way. <laughs> one, two, three, four, five, and then let's go 
like this, and then let's just put. Mm. You annoy me. All right, move out of the way, Cal. <laughs> I need you to move. Let's place these like this. Have a little grate like that. That looks nice. Okay, and then let's have let's have spruce wood <sighs> stairs. Spruce wood stairs. Um, going out of here. Okay, let's go. Actually, let's get some slabs as well. Mm -hmm. Let's do slabs. Okay, let's get a lot of blocks in our hot bar so we have a lot to work with. Um, what if we went down like this? Okay, move, please. You're really annoying me. <laughs> let's go down like this, and that'll give it like a really big slope, like it's almost touching the ground. And then we'll put stairs on top of this. So it has a little bit of curve. And then we'll attach this to the main building. Um, uh, all right. Let's grab some more wood. This will be like probably the edge of the actual building. So let's go one, two, three, and then this will be room for like logs. So let's go ahead and just to show that we're going to put logs here. Let's go ahead and just put some logs down like this. And you know, we can actually, we can make it big like this, or we can just do, we can do one like this, or we could do three like this. And I need to put this here and here. I guess we could, well, we need to actually decide this before we, we finish it off. So let's go. Hmm. Hmm. Also, I don't, I don't think I want it to be exact. I want it to be a little bit random, maybe. So, like, this side's a little bit shorter. Because not all trees are the same height. So it's like we have different height of trees here. Actually, this seems to be the same. We could take this one out, though. Yeah. Maybe? Hmm. I feel like if we do that, we have to make this one shorter, and it just kind of... Alright. Let's just do that for now. <laughs> um, but yeah, we'll do half slabs on the top of this, maybe. Um, we can always change this later if we don't like the look of it. And this will just attach straight up to the siding of the building and let's go ahead and let's just do a okay well this is a half slab I was gonna I was gonna put fences here but then it wouldn't attach to the top there and that would look weird of course, we could make this full blocks. Oh. Decisions, decisions. Oh, man. Okay. I'm thinking we're going to just do one. One beam of wood. Um, so this is like where the guy would store... The lumberjack would store his... Um, his wood. So basically, he would cut down a tree and just move the wood in here, basically. And then we'll have the edge of this building right here. Perfect. All right. And then let's do it again right here. All right. And then do we want to put more fences in? Okay. Like I said before, we have slabs here. So we'd have to make those full blocks. I guess this is fine for now. And then let's go ahead and figure out the side of the building. Um, so we can do... Uh, okay, I know, I know what I want. Let's do cobble stairs. Let's do two things of cobble stairs. And this is probably the last thing we're going to be able to do because this episode is probably getting pretty long already. And then let's just do an access door so we can... Do we want a door? Yeah, I think we're wanting, we want a door so we can get out into the wood area from the house. Um, this won't be our main like entrance, but it'll just be a way to get to the wood. 
and we'll probably put more fences in here eventually. But let's go ahead and put, oh, misplacing blocks like a pro. Let's put blocks in like this, and we're gonna have to do it down there as well. Let's just, I'm gonna have to, I'm gonna collect a lot of wood in between here, um, in between the episodes. And this is just mostly because, um, we're building this mostly because I want to have a little storage area in here, um, which we'll eventually just take out or just replace with things more lumberjacky-ish, if that's a word I can use. <laughs> um, let's just do that. And that'll be the side of our, there we go. Yeah, that looks fine. We actually need to sleep. Okay, so I will, hmm. Okay, I really don't wanna I don't really wanna work on this in between the episodes just because I feel like you guys would miss out on some stuff. Let's put some torches out here just to light the area up. Um But yeah, this will be the end of this episode. Um the first episode. Um hopefully there are many to come. Um thank you guys for watching. Um and I hope you have a a great day. Uh, I will work in between the episodes on gathering wood, and I'll probably do a little mining run, and um, I'll probably get myself um, full iron armor, because we don't really have enough for full iron yet, but um, yeah, I will work in between episodes, um, but this episode's already getting kind of long, so hope you've enjoyed, I know it was kind of a talking, uh, a talky episode, um, Next time we should do a lot more building. We'll finish off the uh, lumberjack's hut and uh, maybe do a little mining run. Uh, so yeah, if you have any uh, suggestions, please put it in the comments section below, um, especially on what kind of style we should do. Um, even though I'm going with like a old-fashioned lumberjack style here, we could um, we could definitely just like move on and do something else somewhere else. Um, um, Something I had thought about before is having like one main base. I think I mentioned this in my Life in the Woods um, series, but I mentioned that we could have one main base somewhere with all our storage, like a um, a futuristic, just um, you know, like a stereotypical base in Minecraft, and then um, we could have little projects going on throughout the world. Like this would be the lumberjack, um, well not lumberjack, but like the the old-fashioned woods. Um, village or something um, and then we can have a modern village or um, a medieval uh, would be a better example <laughs> so we could do that um, but yeah I'm, I'm totally open for suggestions if you have any um, but thank you guys for your support we have we made it up to 500 subscribers um, let's make it up to a thousand <laughs> thank you guys for watching I will Check you guys out next time. Bye.